Setting the project location inside of Revit allows us to specify that our site and our building are located at a specific address on Earth, such as we could tell this building that's going to be located in New York or Rio de Janeiro, or maybe even in Paris. Now, to do this, we can move up to the Manage tab on the ribbon and click on Manage. On the Project Location palette, we can move up here and select on Location. This will bring up the Location, Weather, and Site dialog box. By default, it will try to define the location, in this case, by the Internet Mapping Service. It happens to be Google Maps in this case. We could type in an exact address. We can already see that someone has chosen Manchester, New Hampshire for our building. If we'd wanted to do a different address at this point, we could just highlight this, type in a different address, and then click on search, and it would automatically find that address at that particular location on the face of the Earth. When it does that, it'll also give us a list of all the closest weather stations to that particular spot on Earth. What that's going to allow us to do is be able to specify or be able to size our different mechanical systems inside of our buildings. It'll also give us the appropriate shade and shadow on our building. So as a result of that, we'll be able to do such things as solar studies and a wide variety of other functions. The other way that we can go about doing this is to change this to the default city list. I use this sometimes if I don't really know where my building is going to be at. I just know it's going to be roughly in this one specific area. And then oftentimes I'll come back in later on and change it to the internet mapping service. But this will give us some ballpark numbers. And I will point out that this city list is quite extensive. If it's a major city and it's in a fairly developed part of the world, there's a good chance it'll end up showing actually on this list. If it doesn't, that's okay. It just means they didn't add it. You can either enter in the latitude and longitude here, or once again, go back to the internet mapping service and have it specify that at this part of the world, this is where I want my building to be at. So, the location weather and site can be found underneath the manage tab, the location button, and by specifying the exact address of where your building is going to be located at, you'll be able to do such things as solar studies, be able to size mechanical systems, and a variety of other tasks.